stories about Asian Pacific Islander Americans by telling the story from Korea about a little girl named Yoon Hae, if you remember. And she wasn't sure about keeping her American name, so we heard her story and how she embraced being from Korea. Well, today we're going to Thailand. And remember last week we found Korea on here. Let's pass this along and see if we can find Thailand on there. It's kind of tricky. While we're looking for Thailand, how far do you think Thailand is from Chicago? How many miles do you think? How long? 7,000. 8,400 miles from here. And last week we found out it was 6,000 something to Korea. So we are traveling. We are going farther. Yes, yeah, so it's a little farther. How about how many people do you think live in Thailand? Take a guess. In the millions, I'll tell you that. What do you think? Luca, how many do you think in Thailand? How many live? No, in the millions. Close, close, 67 million. And my favorite fact that we're going to learn about today is the way, the thing that is the most important to the people from Thailand is to be kind and respectful and have joy and a smile on their face, especially in public. When someone makes them, hurts their feelings or makes them uncomfortable or something bad happens, it's very important in their culture to remain with a good face in public because those are the most important things to hold up besides family. So being mothers today, and we heard our scripture about a very selfless mother, I have a story that's a Thai lullaby that a mother sings to their child. And anyone who is a mother who is taking care of small children know that once you get the baby sleeping, what don't you want? For it to wake up. And that's what this story is about. Do any of you here have a special song that you remember that your mom or maybe your mom sings to you when you go to sleep? Or a special story? No? You got it. Oh, what my sunshine. I like that. That's good. I used to sing to the kids a, a uh, maybe unorthodox uh, song from Guys and Dolls, I Love You, a Bushel and a Peck. <laughs> not, not, not something everybody sings as a lullaby. But, so our story today is about this mother in Thailand who gets her children, to, her son to sleep, but then the rest of the world is not cooperating, and it's called Hush. And the important thing is the author, the author, she wrote in the, in the foreword to my father, Ho Wee Ha, whose wonderful bedtime stories of giants and turtles, elephants and warriors would leave me more wide-eyed than sleepy when I was a little girl, girl growing up in Thailand. Hush, who's that weeping in the wind? Wee wee, wee wee, a small mosquito. Mosquito, mosquito, don't come weeping. Can't you see that baby's sleeping? Mosquito, mosquito, don't you cry. My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, who's that peeping from the ceiling? Black cat, black cat, don't come creeping. Can't you see that baby's sleeping? Black cat, black cat, don't you cry. My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, who's that squeaking from the rice bar? Shiny, shiny, a fat gray mouse. Gray mouse, gray mouse, don't come squeaking. Can't you see that baby sleeping? Gray mouse, gray mouse, don't you cry? My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hop, hop, a bright green frog. Green frog, green frog, don't come leaping. Can't you see that baby sleeping? Green frog, green frog, don't you cry. My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, who's that sniffling in the sky? In the sky? Oot, oot, a muddy fat pig. Fat pig, fat pig, don't come sniffling. Can't you see that baby's sleeping? Fat pig, fat pig, don't you cry. My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, who's that beeping by the pond? Gahop, gahop, a glossy red duck. White duck, 
white duck, don't come beeping. Can't you see that baby's sleeping? White duck, white duck, don't you cry? My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, who's that swinging from the trees? Shalak, shalak, a loose-limbed monkey. Monkey, monkey, don't come swinging. Can't you see that baby's sleeping? Monkey, monkey, don't you cry. My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, who's that weeping at the hay? Mau, mau, an old white buffalo, water buffalo. Buffalo, buffalo, don't come sweeping. Can't you see that baby's sleeping? Buffalo, buffalo, don't you cry. My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, who's that shrieking through the forest? Haroof, haroof, a great big elephant. Elephant, elephant, don't come shrieking. Can't you see that baby's sleeping? Elephant, elephant, don't you cry. My baby's sleeping right nearby. Hush, is everyone asleep? All is quiet, all is still. The mother dozes at the windowsill. Nothing stirring, not a breeze, as the moon drifts up over the trees. There is no noise now, there is no sound. Only baby wide awake, his eyes bright and round. <laughs> God is our eternal mother and father, watching out for us. Trying to keep the world at bay when things don't go well for us. But sometimes noises come along and disruptions come. But God will always be there watching over us, caring us for us with a mother's love. Let us pray. Dear God, father and mother to us all, you hold us in your arms. You keep us safe and secure and walk with us when life is not so easy. We are grateful for your love and your eternal love that lasts.